So Zaja wrote in, and he needs some help solving a system of equations. Um, his question was actually a little longer than what I pasted here, but he basically said he didn't understand elimination and wanted a little help understanding it, and that he needed to solve this, uh, this pair of equations right here, 2x plus y equals 4 and negative 2x plus y equals 0 at the same time. Well, Zaja, the whole point um, behind elimination is adding the two equations together so that you get rid of one of the variables. Now this is actually um, sort of a, uh, a one-step elimination process here because these two are already set up so that one of the variables is opposite itself in the other equation. Let me show what I mean by that. Here we have two x's plus y equals four. So we have a positive two x's here and a positive one y, where in your other equation you have negative two x's plus one y equals zero. So here we have a negative 2x. Now normally the first step in elimination is setting up one of your variables to be opposite itself in the other equation. Here that's already done for us. We already know here we have positive 2x and here we have negative 2x that those two things are opposite each other. So all we need to do then is take one of these equations and add it to the other one. And what I mean by that is we're going to take this 2x, negative 2x plus y, and we're going to add it to this other equation. We're going to add it to this side, the left-hand side, of our other equation. When we do that, those two x's are going to get rid of each other. Take a look at, take a look at what happens. We take 2x plus y, and we add negative 2x plus y, and our 2x and negative 2x cancel each other out. This becomes 0, and we have y plus y is 2y. Now we could add this same thing to the other side of this equation, but then we'd have x and y over on this side and we wouldn't be any better off than we started. But since two, negative 2x two plus y is the same thing as 0, we can add that 0 to the other side of this equation over here, and we will have been adding the same thing to both sides. So here equals 0, 4 plus 0 is 4. So now we just have 2y equals 4, and we can divide both sides by 2, cancel, 4 divided by 2 is 2, and find out that y equals 2. Now that we have a numerical value for y, we can take that information and put it back into one of our two starting equations, say right here, and we'll get 2x plus 2 instead of just y equals 4. If we subtract 2 from both sides, this will go away. And we'll get x equals, I'm sorry, 2x equals 2, 4 minus 2, divide both sides by 2, that'll cancel, that'll cancel, we have 1x equals 2 divided by 2, which is 1. So y equals 2 and x equals 1 solves both of these equations. We can check that out by looking here, 2 times 1 is 2, plus 2 equals 4, and negative 2 times 1 is negative 2 plus 2 is 0. So x equals 1 and y equals 2 solves both equations at the same time.